Hello guys, welcome back to a new video. So recently I've picked up a few beauty products. I also did get a few bits in PR, so I thought why not do a beauty slash PR haul. I picked up some really, like, really good bits that I've been dying to try and yeah, I can't wait to show you guys. If you're new here, my name is Anushka. Make sure to hit that subscribe button so you can join the family. And today's post notification shout out is going to go to Thahera Ahmed. Thank you so much for subscribing. I really appreciate it. And if you guys want to get a notification shout out next time, all you have to do is subscribe, press the bell button, and then let me know in the comments below when you've done so. Oh my God, shall we get into it? Oh my God. Do you know what? I'm going to go in with the first thing that I got, right? I picked up the Nimia Where It All Starts Cream. I've been using this for like a week now and it is bomb like my makeup is not moving i love that it's a cream slash primer it says it creates a perfect canvas for luminous skin but can also help you prime the face for those iconic makeup days and yeah i love how hydrating it is it gives a bit of a luminosity it smells amazing any anytime i see anyone talk about this they always mention the scent because it does have like a very unique scent is very sweet but fresh at the same time i don't know but i love it and it makes me want to put it on every day but not only that like i find that my makeup does stay on pretty well especially around my mouth and my nose area so yeah i definitely recommend this i've been loving it so far and another primer to be honest that i've been loving as well is the rare beauty illuminating primer i mean tiktok live is a bit dangerous for me because they have major discounts on there i believe like tiktok works with retailers and they managed to get really good discounts and then they're kind of promoted through influencer lives. I think that's how it works. Anyways, I saw the Olaplex number seven bonding oil and I've been eyeing this for like over a year now and I saw it for 17 pounds, so I picked it up. You best believe I was gonna pick it up because I think this is normally like 28 pounds, so it was a huge bargain. To be honest, I know this is gonna last me a very, very long time because you only need the tiniest amount. Again, it smells really, really good. And yeah, I love Olopex products. So yeah, I'm glad that I've got this now and it's gonna last me ages, honestly. I know it's gonna last me ages. You know when I do these talking videos, my mouth gets so dry and then I can't breathe properly. There's something wrong with me, I swear. I've been really obsessed with perfumes recently. So I decided to try out this set by Replica and I've heard a lot of good things about their perfumes. So you get like a bunch of their familiar scents basically samples of a bunch of their eau de toilettes and a lot of people get these to kind of wear on a holiday or a special occasion so that when you come back to that scent it kind of is like a memory of that day or that experience and i love that but you know i was smelling some of these and i'm not a fond of them, a lot of them like some of them actually smell like men's perfume, which I'm not a fan of. Um, the only one that so far that I really liked is Lazy Sunday Morning. And I just feel like I'm going to be using this for like around the house and stuff to give a scent because on me, I'm not a fan. But I think my favorite one is Lazy Sunday Morning. It smells very fresh, but I think nothing beats Kayali perfumes for me. But I'm glad I tried this. This set was £33, but there I did smell a few and meh. It's a bit meh. So I saw someone use this on TikTok. This is the first instant resurfacing mask. And I swear this girl had like the smoothest skin, like a baby's butt, like honestly. So I'm really excited to try this. It has a HA BHA complex with pineapple enzyme. And then I picked up a favor. I stocked up on the Glow Recipe Banana Souffle Moisturizer Cream. This is amazing. I love to wear this at night. It's just the nicest thing to finish off the day with this moisturizer on your skin it smells really good it feels amazing especially for my dry skin even hubby loves this so yeah i definitely had to stock up on this i missed it i haven't had it in a while at least to say about this one i was a bit shocked i was a bit shocked okay i picked up the brightening saffron serum by ranavat and i've seen a few people mention this guys this box yeah this box that you see that's up against my face i swear my hair's annoying me today yeah it's got a decent size right i'm thinking yeah 33 pounds okay i'll give it a go it's supposed to be really good i opened the box explain explain the size difference if i knew i was getting this tiny ass bottle for 33 pounds i don't know if i would have picked it up honestly so i'm going to be using this very sparingly and who knows i might love it in the end i don't know we're going to have to try it and i'm going to tell you if it's worth the coin in ayurveda 
saffron is considered a miracle elixir for its antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties this is a lightweight serum for all skin types that helps brighten firm and improve tone for glowing youthful resilient skin massage onto clean face neck and decollete while skin is damp so i'm going to keep this for my evening routine oh it's got a very strong scent oh i don't know why i love that scent there's something so relaxing about it i don't know it really has to blow me away because I was very shocked by this size. So yeah, I've, I've, it was on my list to try. So I'm glad I'm gonna I'm going to be able to do that. <laughs> Another skincare product I picked up, and I think this is new. This is the Paula's Choice Essential Glow Moisturizer, and it has SPF 30 in there. Um, again, another thing that shocked me, but this was 11 pounds, so it's all right. But yeah, it's it's tiny. I did really like the toner that I got. So uh, so yeah i just wanted to try it 11 pounds that wasn't too bad so yeah we'll see if i like it or not it says it has kiwi and licorice in here illuminates and hydrates reinforces what makes skin naturally healthy and it's replenishing it has a replenishing cream texture and then another thing i got was the i think this was the last thing i picked up it's the Sai, I don't know how to pronounce it, Sai or Sai Sun Melt Natural Cream Bronzer. And do you know what? I really want to try it right now. I got the medium bronze and I think, I, just, I don't know, there's something about the shade that I really like. Doesn't that just look so lush? So you know sometimes I just like to go with concealer and a bit of cream bronzer and a bit of cream highlighter and I'm done. And that felt really nice. Definitely more on like the wet side. So I feel like it, go, it will be perfect for me because I have really dry skin and I just love that hydrated look to my skin. But I might have to set it with a bit of powder, but I'm not sure. I need to play around with it. Oh, another thing I picked up is the Multitasker Concealer in the shade Honey. I actually picked it up at the same time as the Kind and Free range from Rimmel. I'm going to be reviewing this soon. I thought I'd try this because it looked very intriguing. And I think the shade is perfect. That is a really nice shade. Now moving on to PR. I did get um, this. I did get some bits from AHC, their Youth Focus range. This is what they look like. I think this is available in Look Fantastic. Um... So they sent me the toner, emulsion, cream and essence and it's supposed to be really good to reduce fine lines and wrinkles so it's never too early to start so I'm going to be trying these and see how I get on. You'll definitely hear, I, mean, I need to do more favourite videos because I've discovered so many nice products. I also got a bunch of lippies and lip liners from Colourpop. There's a lot of berries and uh, pink shades in here. I'm more brown gal, as you guys know. But yeah, I might keep some of these for a giveaway. I don't know how Colourpop does it, but they came, come out with an insane amount of releases. They also sent me this Star Wars Darth Vader palette. Okay, that's about it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. I cannot wait to try some of these products. And you know, I miss old fashioned beauty hauls. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Again, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and yeah, I love you guys so much, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!